and in this video PowerDirector is now with stock videos from Pixabay which is quite news to me because I've never heard of Pixabay let me just stop that PowerDirector is using pixabay.com for its stock videos that are completely free to the user once you are using PowerDirector of course you can go up to the pixabay.com website and just get those clips and videos for free anyway similarly the same update for Photo Director is now with Unsplash.com, which I'll cover in a separate video, which is for stock still images or photos. Both of these apps are from Cyberlink. The Photo, sorry, Power Director app is 6.8. I'm recording this on the 10th of May. I'll tell you how this works exactly. So here I am in Power Director. Of course, I've just done a couple of bits of information for you and then I'm now going to show on screen just the website of Pixabay and what it looks like in other words stunning free images and royalty free stock videos whatever over 1.7 million this is how it works and it really does open up the creative element for making videos and I say that with a hesitant sort of thing because every time that I would actually use anything like a photo or video quite honestly I would take the photo or record the video but now if I wanted a beautiful sunrise or sunset over mountains over the sea I couldn't get it easily but in one tap I now can get it which really does take off I would say the incredible heavy lifting to do with making videos to allow maybe a narrative, a story to become ever better. So look, let's just go back to that again. I'm on the main timeline. Of course, top left if you're new to it is video, images and audio. On the left hand side, of course, is to add a video clip on the main timeline and I'm going to tap stock video. Immediately Power Director wants to give me or offer me lots of locked up clips that we have to pay extra money for like this. Now brand new on the second tab is Pixabay. Pixabay? Am I even saying that right? Pixabay. Pixabay? Weird. Doesn't matter. Lovely and it's free. Immediately we've got tons and tons and tons. I would give the advice to say yes of course go looking but have you got a idea of your video in mind because it's you know it's quite therapeutic to get lost in this so I'll do two things first is I will have a look to preview a clip and the one I'm going to look at over here because I did it a couple of seconds ago is nothing more than tapping on a test card up there I can download the video to my device or I could preview it listen and watch of course that's a test card um, we can preview and watch anything else on here. First one, I'm going to demo this and it's very quickly downloading to my device. Once I tap it again, I can hit the plus and of course it jumps down and then it's doing a bit of conversion. Now this is completely new to me, I'll just pause a second and there it is pretty much converted and it's converted on my timeline. So to play this clip, let's see what it actually looks like. Isn't that lovely? Great, so let's go back to our timeline again. And this time I'm going to do one other thing and then quit this video. I'm going to add a clip from stock video, but this is the slight different one. I'm going to go to Pixabay and this time I'm going to search because there is a search box on the right and I'm just going to put um, something like sunrise. And then we can look and search of whatever we wish to. There is another way we can tap the globe icon and that will open up the pixabay.com website. Similarly, because I've done this a second ago, is I'm going to put sun rise and hit enter and then what you'll find on the actual website you get a sponsored bar usually with Shutterstock and then it comes down to all of your free usable clips. Then what you can do is tap that woman in sunrise, is that right? And you can download it. So there we go, that was Power Director now with stock videos from Pixabay. I'm going to leave you with a lovely view.